I always knew that I wanted to foster because my parents were foster carers. I was used to having children coming in and out of the family home. It was nice to know that my parents were helping children from a disadvantaged background. My parents inspired me because they cared for the children. They had a good relationship and that's what I wanted as well for myself, to know that I made such an impact on someone's life. Corinne decided to start fostering when she was 26. When Corinne told me, I was very happy. It's her dream and passion, so I said, go for it, Corinne. When I moved out of home, I was in this four bedroom house by myself and it was lonely. It brought back that fostering is something that I wanted to do. Corinne has absolutely proved people wrong that you can be single, young, without children of your own and you can be a fantastic foster carer. So she really goes against the norm of what we think a foster carer should be. Kareem is such a special foster carer because she cares for sibling groups. It's important for sibling groups to be kept together because these children have a shared identity. They've got shared history and actually keeping children together gives them the opportunity to sustain that relationship with their loved ones. It can be daunting having a large sibling group, but just seeing the children together is the most rewarding part of fostering siblings. I at one point had two sibling groups and that meant I had five children. There wasn't a moment where I was actually sitting down, there was always something to do. If it wasn't the shopping, it was always the housework, helping them tidy their bedroom. My washing machine was constantly going. I had three different school runs to do and so it was definitely hands-on. But it was one of the best moments of my fostering career. Corinne is warm, she's loving, she's so enthusiastic and she's so energetic and I think that any child that comes into her home and into her care will experience all of that. And she does it with such ease and she can go above and beyond like any good parent would for their own children. It's always important I feel as a foster care is to have that warmth and love to show them when they come through that door. A lot of the children don't want to be hugged. A lot of times they just want to reflect on what's happened and where they are. And sometimes it's just giving them that space. So it is making sure that they genuinely know that you are there when they're ready to speak and they do take their time and they do open up. When I do see that progression, it's an achievement for myself as well. And you know that you are actually doing something right in those children's lives. When Corinne set out to do something, she put 100% in it. She has a lot to give. She likes to extend her love, her passion. She just loves to share. I don't see Westwick not being part of my, my life. I've started now, it's all the way. Corinne is very special, one in a million, I would say. <laughs>